Hey guys, I hope you're doing well and welcome back to another video. So in this one, we are going to look at how we can change our mouse cursor. Here, as you can see, I have replaced my default cursor with a new cursor and it's actually a very easy and straightforward process to do. In order to show your mouse cursor when you play the game, all you need to do is to go to your character blueprint or even in your level blueprint and then add this right here so this is pretty simple just add an event begin play next search for get player controller and here go for show mouse cursor we need this set show mouse cursor just connect it to the event and check this option here now when we play our level we are able to see our mouse cursor so now let's see how we can change the icon first you need to find a png to use as your cursor so download an icon for your mouse cursor turn it into a png and then drag it into your content browser here we can't just add this image to our screen and use this as our cursor. What we need to do is to make a widget blueprint and use this image inside the widget blueprint so we can use it on our screen. So here right click, go to user interface and add a widget blueprint. Let's name it new cursor and open it up. Here we need a canvas panel, so search for canvas panel, drag it in and set the size on custom so we are able to adjust it manually. Go for something like 72 by 72 and next add an image on top of your canvas panel. Let's anchor it to the middle of the canvas panel and then adjust the size. All right, now here we can use our PNG. So hit control space to open up your content browser and then drag your icon to this area here. Now you can see that we have our icon, but the thing here is that when you click on something, the middle of the canvas panel will give input to your screen. So we should uh, put the tip of our arrow at the middle of our canvas panel. Just select it and scale it down a little and put it like this so it works properly you can also play with these settings here for example you can change the tint and make it look a little more interesting all right we have our icon here and the next step is to set it as our cursor all you need to do here is to just go to your project settings here search for cursor and here as you can see we have hardware and software cursors in the software cursors just add a new one and here you can see that we have a lot of options but uh, for now let's just go with the default and then here you can choose the cursor you made now you can see that the default cursor is replaced with the one we made Another thing we can do to make it even cooler is to make it change when it's hovered on our UI buttons. Here I have a main menu and I want to make my cursor change when I... By the way, if you want to know how to set this UI for your game, you can watch this video here. This is and our tutorial about how to set this main menus these settings and these options here so in order to do it all you need to do is to just go to your widget blueprint select the buttons you wanna change your mouse cursor on and then here search for cursor check this option here and then here you can choose these different cursors here for example let's go for crosshairs and now you can see that 
it's changed when I hover it on top of my button. You can also make your own cursors as we did before. Just uh, go to your content browser and create another widget blueprint. I'm just going to copy and paste the one I made. And here add your own PNG or just for the sake of showcasing this, just let's uh, change the color and then use it in our project settings. So you can add another software cursor here and let's go for example on hand and then choose the new cursor you made and then here in your main menu select hand and now you can see that it will turn into the new widget blueprint that I made. Yeah, that's it guys for this tutorial and if you enjoyed it, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.